Yeah, hello everyone. Myself Maruti. Welcome you all to Ram Maruti Tutorials with a smile. Okay, so in this video, I have taken a word problem, especially from simple equations. Of course, instead of saying simple equation, I can say simple linear equations. Okay, now I have connected, or in this video, we are connecting the simple linear equations to your geometrical figure rectangle. Okay, so let us come back to the question. So let me explain how we are going to set the equation and how we are going to find the labelings or the length and breadth of a rectangle. That's the concept in this video. Let's come back. Okay, length of a rectangle is 8 meters less than twice its breadth. I repeat, length of the rectangle is 8 meters less than twice its breadth. Okay, now if the perimeter is 56 meters, find the length and the breadth. Okay, now let us search for the keywords in the question, right? The words which can be converted in terms of mathematics. Let's search for such words. If you figure it out, of course, 8 meters, it's a number straight away. Now, less than. That's the first word what we are supposed to bother about. So as you all know, less than means take away minus subtraction first. The next one, twice. Twice is the second keyword which we have to search and transform in terms of mathematical terms, right? So the best thing is whenever we are discussing about twice, it's nothing but two times of something two times of something so i'm converting i'm converting in terms of keywords into mathematical terms less than means subtraction twice means two into something i don't know that something therefore i kept a bracket point one the next one which term is compared to what which term is compared to what that we have to search for that if you see here length length is compared to the breadth right or the width the length is compared to the width we take this as width also right length is compared to the width so it's the tricky part always the one to which it is compared take that as the required variable i repeat the one which is compared to take that as the variable of us now let the let the breadth of rectangle is x meters that's the tricky part what we have got from the first step okay let me let me figure out the question figure for you yes right as you all know this is nothing but the width or the breadth and this is nothing but the length okay just now what did we choose we have chosen we have taken the breadth to be x meters therefore this becomes x meters yes that's what now if we got the breadth what's the length what's the length what is that one what is it two times twice so shall i stay straight away we as we have compared to the breadth shall i take x here yes that's what length of the let the breadth be x then what is twice 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 of breadth is how much is that 2x right 2x meters right but according to the question what he said according to the question according to the question right what he said length is like length is 8 meters 8 meters less than twice it's breadth. This is the question that implies what is left here, right? Now, very, very important trick. Always take the number, whatever it says, in the reverse order. Length is, is means equals, length means L. L equals, L equals the remaining all. As it is moving in this direction, you write in this direction. That's the tricky part. The sentence is going in this direction, 8 meters less than twice its breadth. 
Okay, you take in the reverse direction. 8 meters less. I am taking the reverse direction. Right? This is how I am taking. 8 meters less. 8 meters. If you go in this direction, you have to keep subtraction here. I am going in this direction. 8 meters less than twice its breadth. What is twice its breadth? It's nothing but 2x. Yes, this is the tricky part. English mathematics reversed. This is the thing what we have to remember. Here is the place where you mess up more. Now, let we got it as x meters or the breadth we got it as x meters and the length we got it as 2x minus 8. Now, what else he has given? And what is given? Perimeter equals 56 meters. This is what he has given in the question. The perimeter, perimeter means length of all the four sides. We got it as 56. Now, what's the formula for the perimeter of a rectangle? Simple one. It's nothing but 2 into L plus B equals 56 meters. Right? Now, whatever you got in the place of length and whatever you got in the place of breadth, plug it into that one. So, which implies 2 into, what is the length we have chosen? It's nothing but 2x. 2x minus 8 is the length. Plus, what is the breadth we have chosen? It's nothing but x. Okay, equals how much? It's nothing but 56 meters. Now, simple thing, x calculation part. Now, which implies 2 into inside 2x plus x. It's nothing but 3x minus 8 equals 56 right now let's do one thing 2 is multiplying it here transform to that side 3x minus 8 is equal to 56 divided by 2 if you simplify that 2 ones a 28 so 3x minus 8 equals 28 send this transform minus 8 to the other side it becomes 3x is equal to 28 plus 8 and 3x equals it's nothing but 36 okay now what we want we want x what is 3 doing there it's multiplying send it to the other side x equals 36 by x right 36 by 3 once and 12 so here comes so breath right comma x equals 12 meters here you got this as 12 meters right now oh, oh i don't think it's 12 it's 30 meters it's 30 meters i messed up there so okay three months no it's 12 12 meters there it's nothing but 12 now let's get back to the length length what is it is length equals 2x minus 8 which is nothing but 2 into x is nothing but 12 minus 8 it's 24 minus 8 it's nothing but 16 meters the length is 16 meters and the width or the breadth is nothing but 12 meters let us verify so let us verify perimeter is nothing but 2 into l plus b so 2 into length we got it as 16 and breadth we got it as 12 it's nothing but 2 into 28 which equals 56 meters okay it's verified so let me explain the concept for you here becomes the tricky part simple equations word problems and the concept is rectangle okay choose the words pick the words which can be converted in the form of mathematical terms less than minus twice means two into bracket that's the main logic and to which term it is compared length is compared to the breadth so always take the breadth or the width as the variable so the breadth i have taken it as x here he says twice means two into x okay length is eight meters less than the twice its breadth okay length is l equals but always take the sentence in the reverse way eight meters less than two x now perimeter he has given us 56 i have plugged it in the formula two into l plus b i got the value of x which is nothing but breadth and i got the value of length which is nothing but the length and i have verified it so that's the tricky part converting a word problem in terms of an equation and finding the value of the desired
everyone so welcome back to the application part now so just now in the explanation part i have shown you how the simple linear equations are ap applicable to the geometrical figure which is nothing but rectangle now i am choosing one more let's get back to the one more rectangular one so see the question on the screen now length of a rectangle exceeds its breadth by 4 meters if the perimeter of the rectangle is 84 meters find its length and breadth that is the given question i will read it for you length of the rectangle is length of the rectangle exceeds its breadth by 4 meters what is the keyword what you are able to see there see the keyword there it's nothing but rectangle exceeds you know according to the logic exceeds is nothing but plus you know that yes we have already discussed that in the last videos length of the rectangle exceeds its breadth by 4 meters how much it is exceeding it is exceeding by 4 meters now as we have discussed earlier one concept is compared with the other right the concept is compared with the other so whenever we are thinking that it is compared with the other always uh, the second one should be taken it as the variable the second one whatever it might be it should be taken as the variable right unknown so here what is compared to the what right length is compared to the breadth length is compared to the breadth okay length is compared to the breadth so the second concept the le uh, the length sorry man so the length the length is compared to the breadth okay this length becomes the first concept and uh, breadth becomes the second concept okay the second concept should be taken as x now that becomes the unknown and also now let us write it down let let the breadth let the breadth comma b equals x meters let us compare it as x meters now and what he's saying yes we have taken the rectangle now yes let us draw the rectangle so the breadth we have taken it as x okay the breadth we have taken it as x meters now according to the question what he says the length is compared to the breadth and how much it is exceeding four meters it is exceeding according to the problem according to the problem according to the problem right if you check it out what he says right length is exceeding its breadth length length is exceeding breadth by four meters breadth by four meters that is the point what we have to remember that means that means the length is exceeding exceeding means what plus how much it is exceeding four to whom it is exceeding breadth that is breadth 4 meters it is exceeding exceeding means plus whom you are exceeding it's nothing but breadth but of course breadth we have taken it as x meters that is length equals x plus 4 meters this is the concept of what we are taking now let us take it as x so now we got the two concepts we got the length and we got the breadth now let us see the question back again if the perimeter of the rectangle is 84 what is the perimeter he has given according to the question again but okay perimeter what he has given perimeter is how much he says 84 meters this is what he has given now we know that means perimeter you know the symbol is p perimeter equals 84 meters that is the given question for us now let us simplify that one so you know what is the meaning of perimeter you know the formula for that one 2 into l plus b equals 84 meters this is what he has given for us so 2 into l plus b now, but do you know the values of that how much we have taken length as length just now we got it as what is that x plus 4 plus what is the breadth we have taken it is nothing but x so one we have taken it as a length yes and this is nothing but the breadth of course he has given the answer for us 84 meters it's cool now let's simplify that 2 into if you add the both the x right it becomes 2x plus 4 equals 84 meters this is what we are having now so here it is nothing but in terms of meters now cancel the meter and the meter right now 2 into 
right 2x plus 4 we will do one thing we'll take the 2 right let us take this 2 to the other side this 2 we will take to the other side when it is taken to the other side as you all know it becomes divided but that is 2x plus 4 is equal to 84 by 2 if you simplify 2 once and it is 42 so what we got 2x plus 4 is equals 42 meters this is what we are getting now so let us simplify this one here so now take this plus x to the other side if you take this plus x to the other side you know it becomes minus x that is 2x is equal to 42 minus 4 meters so 2x is equal to how much we are getting 38 and x equals 38 by 2 which is nothing but 19 meters it's nothing but 19 what is that 19 now it is nothing but breath okay comma b equals 19 meters we already got it now what is the other one what we are supposed to get it's very simple it's nothing but the length let's go for here on the top length equals what he says it's nothing but breadth plus 4 so length equals breadth we already got it as 19 meters right and it is 4 meters so length equals it's nothing but 23 meters so this is what the figure what we got now so hope you are able to understand let me recapitulate that one what he says length of a rectangle exceeds its breadth by how many four meters so what i have taken breadth i have taken it as x meters why because length is compared to the breadth always you take variable as the second one the first one is the length and second one is the breadth so i have taken the breadth as x meters right now according to the question what he says length is exceeding breadth by four meters exceeding with what exceeding is nothing but plus that's what you have to remember so length equals breadth plus four that is what so but what is the uh, breadth we have taken breadth is nothing but that x so x plus four meters that is the length now according to the question what is the perimeter he has given perimeter is nothing but 84 meters so perimeter 84 using the formula 2 into l plus b plug in the value of l there as x plus four simplify 2x plus four plus uh, 2 is multiplying if it goes to other side it divides so 84 by 2 42 so plus send it to the other side minus 4 2x equals to 38 if you simplify breadth we are getting it as 19 meters and if you simplify in the length you'll be getting the length as 24 meters so this is the application i'm giving one more sum for you you practice it better hope you are able to understand the simple linear equations under the geometrical figure hope you are understanding thank you In this channel, I have been placing both math and science videos.